It's the 2K Sports Pregame Show, sponsored by Kia. Hello, everybody. Ernie Johnson here with Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny the Jet Smith. Great to have you with us on 2K Sports. Tonight, it'll be the Cleveland Cavaliers going up against the Golden State Warriors at Oracle Arena. Well, for the Warriors, this is a game that may be determined early, and they have made it clear that their focus is to limit mistakes and deliver the defensive and offensive performance they're capable of. And Stephen Curry, one of the guys you'll be seeing tonight, this guy is, uh, you know you know what I like to say, don't you, Kenny? Oh, he yeah. makes it look effortless. Is it fair to call him the best player in the league at this point? There's no way to effectively guard him. So calling him the best player might be a name that he should be tagged on to Stephen Curry. There are some names to consider. Obviously, LeBron James, I can go down the list, but Steph Curry is at the top right now. His efficiency, proficiency, and his ability to take over game arguably make him the best. He gets it done every night. It's like we're it's like we're watching a video game when we watch this guy play. Yeah, yeah. I've, I've never seen a video game actually play basketball. It's amazing. NBA Two K Seventeen. This guy. I've I've, yeah. I've actually I, I gotta watch that man. You, you know what I like to say about him? He makes, makes it, it look, look effortless. effortless. Kevin. Me, I'm just done, 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 done. Downtown Oakland looking majestic from high above as we welcome you to tonight from just down the road at Oracle Arena. We have an interconference affair lined up for you today as the Cleveland Cavaliers come in for this one. 2K Sports is proud to present NBA Basketball. I'm Kevin Harlan. We've got Steve Smith and Greg Anthony alongside our sideline reporter tonight, David Aldridge. And we've got time for a quick pregame report. With that being said, let's head to the sideline in our Hall of Famer, David Aldridge, D.A. Well, Kevin Durant is back after missing most of 2015 after requiring a third surgery to repair a bone in his foot. He said it was the first time I had to face something being snatched away from me that I loved so much. I just tried to stay positive and feel that if I put the same work ethic in, then things will turn out all right for me. Kevin. Great to have him healthy and back out on the floor, D.A. Thank you. And tonight, Steve, two top-tier teams going head-to-head. -head. A lot of excitement around this one. You want to see the best in the business go at it. Then you get a chance to measure yourself if you're one of those teams. I think other guys watching it on other teams, you get a chance to see great basketball. And think of the viewership for this team, too, on 2K. Nice They're going to love huh? watching this one. Huge! What was that again? Huge! <laughs> <laughs> Look at Cleveland's starting group. LeBron and Love, the two superstar forwards. Sharpshooters Irving and J.R. Smith are the backcourt duo. And it's Thompson in at the five. Now, here is Irving. Oh, and here we go. Green's got it. The pass break chance. From the top of the key, he buries it. Look at Green trucking down the floor with his quick feet and getting the ball right where he wants. Irving against Curry. Outside Irving. The screen from Thompson. And here's James outside. Green with the rebound. Good little two-man action there, but they just can't get the shot to fall. What you ask for is execution, and those shots will fall later. Unloads from 13. The shot, no good. Wow, see, that's a shot you hate to miss. Point-blank range, too. Irving kicks to Thompson. Excellent D there from Pachulia. That was a huge face-off at the rim. Two great competitors. Defense took it. Curry, a screen on LeBron. Green, the screen. Durant for three. It's good. He makes his first shot of the game. How do you stop a seven-footer who gets his shot off that quickly from range? KD, one of a kind. Irving with it. Now Green defending. A nice shot by Irving. Warriors have gone two or three here to start off the game. Curry with it. Green, the screen. The tray. And again, it's good to rent with a three. 
Durant's got six points. You know, the defense has got to do a much better job of fighting over those screens. You know, that job of getting through screen is not pretty, but somebody has to do it. The putback controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. The unbelievable effort. Thompson, a dedicated warrior on the offensive glass. Thompson passes to Durant. Thompson outside. Launches it. And that's out of bounds. Golden State will retain possession. And one of the most resilient players around, Tristan Thompson, hasn't missed a game with injuries since 2012. And for a big man who plays the way he does, battling in the paint, going after every rebound, and also being the muscle for his team, it's impressive he's played this many games. Green, the screen. Takes the 13-footer. Land soft on the front of the rim and drops. And the story here, Kevin, early on is how well they shot the basketball. Irving dishes to Thompson. Can't get it to fall. See, when you're going into the teeth of the defense, you have to go harder. A soft lay-in won't cut it. And the rejection by Smith. The three from LeBron. Now in the scoring column with that deuce. One for two this game. We talk about LeBron's amazing versatility, that time showing confidence from deep. Floats one up, and the rejection by James. In the corner, Irving with it, fires the three. No good, shot missing. Curry with some nice D. Warriors leading by three. Here's Durant. Great D that time from James. Not the best shot right there with a good defender draped all over you? No, not at all. When you see him guarding you, just try to move the basketball on. And you saw how quick the defense was. They were ready for him. They got the hand in the face there and made that much more difficult. And that kind of tear defense is crucial to any team's success. Gotta defend the paint. I like that shot for him, though. Very little defensive pressure. He typically rises up and buries that. Thompson. Goes back up, and he sinks the layup. Refining his skill set inside, you see the work Thompson's putting into his game. Curry kicks to Pachulia. Over in the corner, Green. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Green's got his second bucket. Obviously, the defense was not in sync out there, and they took advantage of it. Durant against James. Smith kicks to Love. Irving for three. That shot, no good. The Warriors go the other way. Thompson outside, and Tristan Thompson gets the whistle that time. That's his first foul. First first foul. Nineteen seconds left here in the first quarter. Here's Iguodala. Iggy is so creative down low, just overwhelming the defense with his athleticism. This is his first free throw of the game. Shoot two. First free throw is good. And Iguodala drops in both. The free throw line is something that Iggy needs to work on. He's hit and miss from there. Now Williams. Kicks it to James. From 12 feet out. And misses it off the right side of the rim. And so the first quarter is in the books. Warriors lead by five. And the second quarter will be on the way when we come back.
and LeBron James trying to will his Cavaliers team to a title. Teammate Kevin Love says LeBron made it clear from the start what he expected. He sat us down um, you know, maybe right before the first practice and kind of spoke about what he thought everyone should bring to the table. And, um, you know, we had to hold up our end of the bargain. Now when someone like LeBron talks about what you need to bring to the table, you, you better bring it. <laughs> There's no doubt about that. Dub the new big three along with Kyrie. I think if they just keep following LeBron's advice, the sky's the limit. All right, the second quarter beginning in just a moment. What do you guys think about the Warriors here so far? Not much room to operate offensively. The defense has been stifling through the first. And they really are just giving them no breathing room out there. They have completely flustered them and set the pace of this game in their favor. A lot of defense at the forward spots with Igudala and Green. Livingston is out there with Ian Clark, and it's West in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. So that's the group out there for Golden State. Livingston, that's good. And the relationship between a coach and his players, so critical, obviously, to a team's success. What qualities, Steve, in your mind, make a great coach? Well, I think the coach, first of all, has to be a great X and O's. But then I think he has to have a great feel for different personalities. Then I think he has to build the right culture that fits everybody. And here are the Cavaliers now. The Warriors making the shot. Again, James missing. And see, he had his momentum going forward, but really didn't need to lean in there. He was wide open. Now, here's Livingston. He's guarded by Williams. Out of bounds. Out of bounds. Cleveland will take possession. You know, depending on the game situation, that kind of mistake can be deadly. Come on, you got to have awareness on the court. Durant's checked in for Green. Cleveland also making some changes. Love comes in for LeBron. That's Dunleavy in for Jefferson. Pass to Dunleavy. Back to Williams. Love with a wide open look. That drops, and it comes off an assist from Williams. One of the best catch and shooting big men we've ever seen, Kevin Love. Warriors leading by four. And we've got an update here, so let's check in with David Aldridge reporting from the sideline. Well, the league and NBA teams have been at rest and sleep are a huge part of that. Warriors head coach Steve Kerr said medicine and science have improved and thought processes do as well. He said in the old days, guys played 48 minutes. Well, we've made advances. We don't go backwards with this stuff. We go forwards. And guys, that's why they want their players off their feet as much as possible. Good report, GA. Thank you. And the Cavaliers making a change here. Irving's checked in. Feeds it to Fry. Unloads from 13. That one drops for him. Fry has got his first two points. As a defender, you have to stay in Fry's shirt. Otherwise, all too often, this will be the result. And Kyrie Irving, one of the most talented scorers, certainly Smitty, in the NBA, but he feels the pressure, I think, to try to tighten the screws in his game defensively. You don't get many nights off defensively at the point guard position in today's NBA. That position is very deep. No excuses, though. To be great, you've got to get it done at both ends. Here is Luck. Kevin Durant picking up that last basket. Love gets to jump from deep. Another three for Cleveland. And the team wants Shumpert to be a 3 and D guy. Just has to be more consistent out there. Livingston passes to Durant. They set the pick. Livingston dishes to West. Durant in the corner. The shot's good on the assist by West. Durant's got five points in the quarter. Taking good shots overall, hitting a high percentage of them. That's what has this team rolling. Count it, and the Warrior lead has been cut down to just two points with the bucket from Kyrie Irving. Here is Livingston following the basket by Kyrie Irving. Durant sets a screen for Iguodala. Picked by West. Livingston kicks to Clark. Another three for Golden State. A much better quarter for them shooting the ball. The Cavaliers trail by five. Outside Irving. One thirty-six left to play here in the half. Another three for Cleveland. 
You know, he's had better starts, obviously, but he's shaking it off here in the second. There's the dish to Livingston. Here's Clark. They set the pick. It's stolen by Dunleavy. There's the pass to Irving. Baseline try. And again, it's Cleveland. And now he's taken a solid opening in the quarter and built on it here time out, time in the out. second. And the Warriors decide to take their first time out here. Julia, he's checked in for West. Draymond Green comes in for Kevin Durant. Clay Thompson, he's checked in for Ian Clark. And Curry subbed in for Sean Livingston. A big group substitution here for Cleveland. Tristan Thompson, he's checked in for Fry. LeBron comes in for Kevin Love. Jefferson's checked in for Mike Dunley. And Smith subbed in for Iman Shumpert. Now here's Curry. Up and in, off to an efficient start. Two for three from the field. Now he's one of the best of the business in scoring inside the paint. That is dangerous. James outside. On the wing, Irving. Guarded by Kerr. The three. And LeBron with the basket. The assist by Irving. James has got six. It's impossible to stop him. You can only hope to contain him. I like the move to go two for one here. That has to be the plan. Let's see if they recognize it. Here's Thompson, and the Warriors take on two more. Incredible effort from Thompson over some pretty good defense. Sometimes one man is not enough to throw his game off. Just one second between the shot clock and game clock. The screen from Thompson. There's 14 seconds left in the first half. Now here's LeBron. Six points for him. Down to five on the shot clock. Nice shot by Smith. Deadly from beyond the arc. JR cannot be left alone. Kurt. That one misses. And we're through the first half of basketball here in what's been a good one. Cavaliers on top. Up by two. And a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge standing by courtside. David. Thanks, Kevin. Alongside Steve Kerr and Coach, what is the offensive approach going to be in the second half? Well, we just have to do what we do, move the ball uh, and wear them down with our ball movement, our cutting, and our spacing, and set better screens, all the, all the usual stuff. Yeah, it always seems to work out for you in the long run. Thanks, Steve. Back to you, Kevin. Thanks so much, David, and we'll step away briefly, but get you right back out here for the start of the third quarter after this break. It's the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hello again, everybody. Ernie Johnson, joined by Kenny Smith, right there, and Shaquille O'Neal, he's right there. Welcome to the NBA Halftime Show on 2K Sports. The first quarter for the Cavaliers was fairly even. The game was always within a fairly narrow margin, with their largest deficit of the period being six. They took control of the game in the second quarter, coming back to take a two-point lead into the locker room with them. Kenny, your thoughts. How are the Cavaliers playing? Well, it's always a little bit of a challenge playing on the road, but they came in mentally prepared and physically prepared. The energy in the arena was fierce, but they didn't cave in. Shaq, 
How'd you think the Warriors were playing? The way they were getting rain on from three, they're lucky to still be in this. In some cases, it was shooters making contested shots, but in others, it was defenders leaving shooters wide open. You can't do that. Bottom line, their perimeter defense was lax, and that needs to change, and that's a fact. Oh, 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 I was rhyming, Ernie. And that's it for halftime, as the second half is just about to get underway. See you after the game. Welcome back to the Bay Area, everyone, as we take a peek at Coit Tower with the skyline of gorgeous San Francisco just behind. Welcome back, everybody. The start of the second half getting underway. Both teams battling hard through the first half. We've seen Kevin Durant really having a great game. Yeah, you just love it when the decision-making is as good as it was there in that first half. Didn't force anything. Just fundamentally sound basketball. That's what you want out of your offense of each and every game. And Smitty, you were just starting in the league when NBA basketball games were becoming what they are today in the 90s. The popularity of the game has just increased so substantially. Was it strange to see yourself being portrayed in video games as uh, we see now? And, and how did you react to it? You know, very humbling, Kevin, to get a chance to see yourself, uh, your name being called in the video game. But what I did like, Kevin, I was so skinny. The video game had me looking buff with oh, muscles yeah. and everything. So I like that. You look pretty good right now. Yeah, yeah that's because you're my friend. <laughs> so on the floor for Cleveland, sharpshooters Irving and J.R. Smith are the backcourt duo. LeBron and Love, the two superstar forwards. And it's Thompson in at the center filling out the middle. Okay, well, let's check in with David Aldridge, who's reporting from the sideline. Well, guys, we know our old friend Steve Kerr was new to coaching when he took the reins of the Warriors, but he'd mentored under the greats. He said that Phil Jackson and Greg Popovich both had an almost scary amount of presence. As for Steve, he said, I'm very laid back. I believe in the calm presence of a coach, more so than the ranting and raving and screaming and yelling. I guess that's what he says to the referees anyway, guys. Cool under pressure, but D.A., he's as competitive as they come. Thank you. Golden State's gone one or two from beyond the arc since coming out of the break. Durant, the pass to Curry. On the wing, and a foul called on the shot. Got him on the way up that time, so he'll shoot two right here. It's going to be on Kyrie Irving. Although it is a clear cut that Curry is the best player in the game right now, he certainly has the best case. Back-to-back -back MVPs, and, and Steve, the impact he has on the court is just peerless. You can throw other names in as well, but Curry and his back-to-back -back MVPs puts him in elite company. He is quickly rising on the all-time greatest players list. He's earned it, and he has transformed the art of shooting. That's also good. So he hits both free throws. He just can't miss from the line right now. He is the guy you want taking those shots. Pick it up, pick it up. And uh, we're about a minute and a half here into the second half. Love at the elbow. 16 feet away. That one wide left. You love the close out on that possession. I love it because you don't give up on the play. Just that little contest bothered his shot. Now here's Pachulia. He's had some playing time, but no scoring yet from him. Six to shoot. Golden State needs to get off a shot. Good, and Curry gets the assist. And the Warriors lead by three. Exactly what you want from your point guard. A guy who can lead this team and wants to get his guys open looks. And a wide open look for Irving. Drills the three-pointer. Irving's got five points now this quarter. 
Yeah, those are starting to add up, guys. Up their last five baskets, three have been tripled. Curry setting the pick for Durant. Pachulia with the screen on Thompson. Back to Curry, pulls up. And there are the Warriors now with another bucket. And that's three out of four now coming out of the break. The offense playing with a purpose. Love outside. And Thompson sends it back. Don't underestimate Clay Thompson on the defensive end. Perfect timing on the block. It's Curry outside. Curry with another miss. And the great shooters know when they've got enough opening to go for the three. I didn't think it was a bad choice on that possession. The Warriors making a switch here. West is checked in. And then for Cleveland, Channing Fries checked in for Love. Dunleavy comes in for James. And it's Amon Jumpert in for Smith. And now we're three minutes into the third quarter of play. Here's Dunleavy, defended by Durant. Shumpert against Curry. Shumpert, no good. The Warriors leading. To the middle. Here's Green. And he gets that one to go off the front iron. Green's got six. And what an incredible sight it was to see the city of Cleveland in jubilation last June. Their first professional sports championship since 1964. It was a long time coming, but most fans in Cleveland probably didn't even remember the last time they won a title. And to have that title submitted by Akron's own LeBron James, you couldn't have written it any better. A second chance effort. And Thompson gets it to go. Seven points in the game. Great effort from Thompson using his lint to his advantage there. Curry against Shumper. Irving sets a screen for Shumper. Launches a three. Again, Shumper missing. Warriors leading by four. Thompson in the corner. Back to Green. Golden State moving the ball around. Here's Curry with the three. An absolute bomb from three-point range. And, and you like to see since the half now. He's finally starting to come around. And it's Shumper penetrating. Irving from long range. Good for his eighth field goal. He's attempted a dozen shots. His marksmanship this quarter has been unbelievable, yet they still trail in this game. Three-second difference between shot clock and game clock. Durant kicks to Curry. From deep. Another miss by Curry. And this quarter, he has clearly been off the mark. And here is Irving. Shumpert in the corner. Beyond the arc. Good, and the assist goes to Irving. Irving's got three assists now in this one. And credit Kyrie. Tremendous vision. Finds the open man. And we've reached the end of the third quarter. Just a terrific game so far. Warriors lead by one. It's the NBA on 2K Sports from Oracle Arena in Oakland, California. Now let's listen in to head coach Steve Kerr. Get a couple stops, we get a couple runouts, we get into our flow, all right? Keep the ball moving, keep the intensity. Steve Kerr asking his guys just to you know, keep up the pace, play unselfishly, basically be yourself, stay, uh, guys, stay in character. Yeah, I mean, he knows what this team is capable of, just looking for a couple of plays to really kind of kickstart that engine and, and give them that little sustainable groove. We've got a great game on our hands as we welcome you back. The fourth quarter of action getting started. A lot of defense at the forward spots with Igudala and Green. Ian Clark out there with Livingston. And it's Pachulia in at the five. That's the Warriors' five. Outside Williams. Jefferson kicks to Smith. Outside Williams. The feet to Love. Over Pachulia. 
And it's off the back rim. No good. Golden State's gone. Six of 12 from outside. A very nice 50% mark. Shooting the three ball well. Iguodala with the bucket. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Screen by Smith. LeBron dishes to Williams. Back to LeBron. We're just over a minute into this final quarter of play. Unable to get that one. Iguodala, the pass to Livingston. Fires the three. And Iguodala is good for three. And the Warriors lead by six. Such a sweet stroke from Andre on the three ball. Always a danger to light it up from there. Outside, Williams. James outside. Solid shot from the distance of about 14 feet. Key buckets, and we know he delivers down the stretch. There's no one else they want with the ball in his hands and the game on the line than this fella. Really starting to attack on the interior here, showing a much more physical presence here in the second half. First The free throw drops for Pachulia. And one thing with Coach Kerr, he'll always defer credit and glory to his players. He's always done it. He is constantly praising their efforts to the media as the sole reason for their success. And a prime example of that was last year in the Western Conference Finals. Kerr didn't go to the podium for the trophy presentation, wanted only the players to have that moment. Very much a player's coach. Some changes for Golden State. Clay Thompson comes in for Ian Clark. And Steph Curry is subbed in for Sean Livingston. And Cleveland also making a change. Thompson, he's checked in for Jefferson. Pass to Williams. Back to James. From close range. Hits some rim on the way in. And the bucket's good. James has got four points now in the quarter. Curry kicks to Thompson. Here's Green, and Thompson sends it back. Great timing by Tristan Thompson on that block. That's his forte. A little over two and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth quarter. James up top. He's covered by Iguodala. Shot clock at five. Releases. And he didn't get quite enough under that one. Warriors leading by five. Pass to Thompson. From deep. Good. And Curry gets the assist. Ten points for Clay Thompson. Practice makes perfect. Thompson is just lights out on these shots. James against Iguodala. Down low. Here's Thompson. Doesn't go that time. Excellent D there from Pachulia. Williams against Curry. A chance there to push it to double digits, but it's off the mark. And here we go. Fast break. LeBron's got it. Took him no time at all on that one. Completely in rhythm that time. LeBron working off the catch and shoot. Golden State's gone two for two from three-point land to start the fourth quarter. Petrulia with the screen on Williams. The basket drops and he gets fouled on the shot. One free throw coming his way. Not the best pick I've ever seen, but it was just enough to get the job done. Durant's checked in for the Warriors. Irving's checked in for Cleveland. The free throw drops for Pachulia. And a little over three and a half minutes in the books so far here in the fourth. Irving dishes to James. Here's Thompson. Goes up and lays it nice and easy. Keeping his head on a swivel. LeBron locates the open man. Guys, a good chance for them to slow it down. Yeah, they definitely should use some clock here. Here's Durant. Second chance shot. He takes it up and lays it in. 
Durant's got the lead up to nine now for the Warriors. And the defense just gets caught standing around that time and giving up the second chance opportunity. Second chance points can kill you. You must concentrate on the defensive glass. 46 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Curry with a wide open look. And another three I'm for Golden State. He just exudes a love of the game, guys. You can see it in everything he does. This guy lives and breathes the game. Timeout called Cleveland. They're losing by nine. There's 39 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Some changes for Golden State. David West is checked in for Draymond Green. Ian Clark comes in for Thompson. And it's Livingston in for Curry. And the Cavaliers will go with a different look here. Channing Fries checked in for Thompson. Dunleavy comes in for Kevin Love. Ramon Shumpert is checked in for J.R. Smith. And Mo Williams subbed in for Kyrie Irving. There's 39 seconds left to play in the final quarter. And here's LeBron outside. It's Clark with the rebound. And they're on the break. Releases from 15. And another basket for Golden State. Just look at how quickly the lead has grown here over the last few possessions. I mean, the game is in hand, but they're still running their offense. And they're just plain and simple, still making shots. There's 18 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Durant with it. So we see the Warriors get the win here. Even early on in this one, it seemed like they were happy to be playing at home tonight. And it makes a big difference. And once they started to really play in rhythm, you never felt like they had any doubts as to whether or not they were going to win. And now let's catch up with David Aldridge, who's standing by from the sideline. All right, Dave. Thanks very much, Kevin. Night and day for the defense. What was better in the second half? Well, early in the game, they got some easy threes, four or five threes. They had a great shooting team, and they are great in the paint. So we just had to make a second effort. I think the only adjustment we made was playing harder. And uh, we just got to continue to you know, keep playing together on both ends. Yeah, Chuck Daly used to always say defense is all about effort, and you showed it tonight. Thanks. Back to you, Kevin. All right, David, thank you. Well, folks, that's going to do it for now. For Steve Smith, Craig Anthony, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan thanking you for tuning in. See you next time. The 2K Sports Post Game Show. Thanks, Kevin. Now we have the opportunity to present our Jordan player of the game, Stephen Curry. I've never ever 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 seen a small guard dominate a game like Steph Curry is able to do. Not his father, not his grandfather, not anybody. This kid right here brings a special excitement to every game he plays. This kid right here is the game right now. If you want to watch basketball, you better watch this guy. He's that type of player I've never seen before. Wow, what a player he is. From an offensive standpoint, he deserves a pat on the back tonight. He helped his team set the tone and the pace early on. Gave the defense fits. Can't ask for much more. And that's it for tonight. But we've got a whole new NBA season ahead of us. For Shaquille O'Neal. For Kenny the Jet Smith. For Kevin Harlan, wherever he might be. And the entire 2K Sports crew. I'm Ernie Johnson. We'll see you again very soon.